I'm just trying to make it all make sense. Me. More. You. No. Podcast. Today I want to go through an audio-based visualization exercise that's discussed in Be Unstoppable by Jack Canfield, David Meltzer, and Cynthia Kersey. And this visualization exercise will assist in visualizing your ideal life so then you can manifest it into reality. The exercise is intended to be done alongside an audio recording, which is this podcast itself. And there's seven categories that you'll be going through with this exercise. And as we go through these seven categories, you should pause for about a minute to visualize each. Before we begin the visualization exercise, I ask you to pause the podcast now and take some time to listen to some relaxing music in a comfortable environment. Doing so will assist in setting the tone and getting the most out of this visualization exercise. So I now assume that you've paused the podcast and you're ready to now go through the visualization exercise. First, visualize your financial situation. How much money do you have in your savings? How much income do you bring in? What is your overall net worth? What is your cash flow like? Now envision your perfect home. What does your home look like? Where is it? And now visualize walking through your perfect home. Next, visualize your career. What are you doing in your career? Where are you working? Who are you working with? What is your compensation like? And is it your own business or are you working for somebody else? Now focus on your free time. What are you doing with family and friends during free time? What hobbies are you pursuing? And what kind of vacations do you take? Next, visualize your body as well as your emotional and spiritual health. Are you free and open, relaxed, perseverant, largely in an ecstatic state of bliss? What does that look like to you? Now visualize your relationships with your family and friends. What is your relationship with family like? Who are your friends? What is the quality of relationships with your friends? What do those friendships feel like? Are they loving, supportive, and empowering? Or could they be better? The sixth category to visualize is surrounding your own personal growth. What training do you see yourself going through? Do you see yourself going to school? And is there any form of therapy that you should seek for something that hurt you in the past or growing spirituality? Now lastly, visualize the community that you live in and your network. What does your ideal community and network look like? What kinds of community activities take place? Are you playing soccer, going golfing, going to a farmer's market, or something else? Now think about charity work that you participate in. What do you do to help others and make a difference? How often do you partake throughout the week in making an impact in the community? And lastly, who are you helping? Now that you've visualized these seven categories of the exercise, take some time to write down what you visualized, and understand that this is an exercise that you should come back to regularly. Visualizing your own ideal life will assist in making it a reality, and by manifesting your own ideal life into reality through keeping these seven categories in mind, you will no doubt craft a life of significance. trying to make it all make sense. Me. More. You. No. Podcast.